Hey guys, how are you? I am back with another meal prep video for this week and I am hopefully going to be on a good schedule now with videos. The plan is for Wednesdays to be a meal prep video so that you guys can get all your ingredients ready um, over the weekend and ready for next week and give you guys some ideas. And then I'm hoping for Friday to be a recipe type video. And that one might change if I don't have a recipe. It might just be like a motivational video. Um, you know, just something, you know, that just is fun. And then I want to get my workout videos to you guys. So things that I've been doing, ways I've been building muscle, working with my personal trainer three times a week, also running on my own three or four times a week. So yeah, I've been doing a lot and I wanna fill you guys in on all of that and those videos will hopefully be Saturday or Sunday. That is the plan. I know I've had a lot of plans in the past, but now that I have my new job um, with the Navy full time and I've gotten used to that schedule and gotten used to my workouts and you know, kind of figured it all out. So. <laughs> Fingers crossed, uh, you guys will see me three times a week. All right, so my food's been pretty much the same, but we will probably get into my macros and different things I've been trying out later in the future. Without further ado, let's get into the meal prep. All right, first easy meal is this Asian-inspired ground beef with vegetables. I'm just adding some of this frozen veggie blend. It's got broccoli, cauliflower, red peppers, and carrots. Also some minced garlic and cocoa aminos. This does have some sugar in it, but it's not much when you consider it's going over um, the entire batch of food, so don't get too worried about things like that. And then we're also going to add in some scallions and red onions, cover and let that cook for a while. So I left the grease in from the hamburger meat and then I added a cup of water when I was letting it just cook. And I wanna thicken this sauce up so I took about a half cup of that sauce, adding about a tablespoon of xanthan gum. We're just gonna give it a stir separately and pour it back in, stir it all back up. I'm adding some bean sprouts and then we're just gonna cover and let it cook uh, some more. So probably about you know, 15 more minutes, just let it sit there on low heat. The next meal prep is a cauliflower fried rice with full of sausage, or you could also use hot dogs. With a little olive oil, I'm gonna saute up some red onions, green scallions. I wanna make this spicy, so I'm using some red hot peppers and some jalapenos. I've scrambled up four eggs. We're gonna get that in there and just chop up the egg real fine. These are the pull of sausage I got. I found them at Costco. Ingredients are good, um, seem pretty healthy compared to others. So I used about six pull of sausages here, cut them up in pieces, and I have this riced cauliflower. It's just plain from Costco as well. I like that it comes in separate bags. You can heat it up in the microwave or just pour it right in like this. And I'm gonna go ahead and use up the rest of this cocoa amino. It's gonna give it that nice brown color and a great flavor. I love having salads during the week as well, so if you just prepare some salad, like cut it up, keep it in the fridge, and then have a couple proteins to put on top, it's gonna be super easy to have a salad later. I just use some chicken tenders here. We're gonna bake them, some olive oil, whatever spices you like. I use salt, pepper, some garlic powder, and you're just gonna bake those at 350 degrees for 25 minutes. I also love having tuna salad to put on salads. It's even a nice go-to when you're just wanting a snack on something. You can get a spoonful of tuna, and I don't, for me, like it always tastes pretty good even late at night. This time, I wanna make it spicy, so I tried some hot sauce, some spicy red peppers and jalapenos, some red onions, and it came out delicious. Give it a try. And that is it for this simple, yummy meal prep. I hope you guys will try this at home, play around with some spices and sauces. And yeah, that cauliflower rice you can do so much with and it's even great to eat cold. All right, that is it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the little bell, that'll notify you the next video that comes out, which is hopefully Friday. Not hopefully, no, it's gonna be Friday. It's gonna be Friday. <laughs> All right guys, take care, bye.